Hello, this is Lana from Modern Home Systems Rancho Santa Fe bringing you today's tech tip. Passwords and autofill on iOS 7. Okay, the benefits of password and autofill is you'll be able to automatically fill out web forms using your contact info, previous names and passwords, or credit card info. Um, the first step before getting into this is we want to go down to our contacts and once we're in our contacts we want to enter in as much information that we can that would help fill up these web forms a lot faster so you can go through your phone number uh, your email and your address once you have entered those in there we can start by going into settings and this is where we'll set up our passwords and autofill once you're inside settings we're gonna go down to the fourth section in the very bottom where it says Safari and we're gonna select Safari once in Safari, you can see the second choice is going to be passwords and autofill. This is what we're going to be working with today. Select that. All right, and once we're in here, you can see we have the option right here to add our own info. So we're going to hit this little toggle switch here and add contact info. That'll automatically add anything you do on a web form with your name, phone number, email, and address. The second option down here is names and passwords. And this is when you're in sites like Facebook and uh, other sites you frequently visit. It will have your username and password saved in there. We're going to select that. And it's going to ask us to put on a passcode. And we're going to want to do this so if anybody else gets a hold of our phone, they won't be able to use uh, our passwords or um, our username without entering this code in. So we're going to go and select turn on passlock. Uh, for now, I'm just going to enter in four zeros, four zeros let that process all right there you go um, and right below that once that's in there the passcode set we can go into save passwords you can see I have none in here but if you go to Facebook and other sites you have and it says remember my password and you hit yes this is where the passwords will be stored we're gonna go back to autofill um, we can also do this here which is always allow uh, and not all sites will ask you to remember its password but if you select this it'll automatically remember for every site uh, that you want it to be. So if you don't have a good memory, that might be a good one to select. And down to the final stage is credit cards. And when you select credit cards, automatically it'll turn on credit cards. So if you're at sites like Amazon and other retail stores online, it'll automatically fill in your credit card information. And after that, you can go down and add to save credit cards. Right here, you can see you have a uh, one option, and that is add credit card. We're going to select that. And you can see here, we have a Johnny Appleseed, where you can enter your name, credit card information, expiration date, and a description of the card, MasterCard, Visa, Amex, etc. We're going to hit cancel. And once the card is all set in there, uh, you basically, that's it. You're all done. The only thing you may have to enter in credit card information would be your security code on the back or front of the card. All right, so that was adding passwords on autofill and iOS 7. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Thank you. And for any more information, feel free to contact us here at the Rancho Santa Fe location and we'll be glad to help.